People come at me like I created these bags and it's very annoying, honestly, at this point. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, as you can see by the title, today we're going to be doing the bags video. So if you have not seen the accessories video, I'll link that in the cards and down below. And I'll also link the heels video as well. Definitely be sure to check those out. This is part three, yeah, part three of my accessory series. Like I said, I still don't know about the sunglasses. I'm probably going to just include those in like a collective haul or something like that because I don't know, I just feel like an entire video on sunglasses. Even though I love them, I feel like a lot of people don't really care too much about them. So like I said, I will probably include them in a collective haul. Let me know down below. I know a lot of people said they wouldn't mind seeing an entire video on sunglasses. So I don't know, maybe I feel like I could, I don't know, I'm still debating, but this is going to be the bags video. So these are literally some of my favorite bags for the summertime specifically. This is not my entire bag collection because we would literally be here forever and i don't want to do that because there's just a lot so yeah eventually one day i will do like an entire bags collection if you guys want to see that let me know but this is just summer so before we get into the video i know someone's going to ask about this shirt this is from fashion nova i featured this in a collective haul some months ago and it was sold out then and i'm pretty sure it's still sold out but i will link it below so you guys can turn on your notifications and maybe it'll come back in stock and this headband was sent to me from a subscriber and I freaking wish I could remember the name. I lost the freaking card because I had like a pile of basically all of my P.O. Box stuff. And I have been in love with this headband ever since I opened it. But I could not find the freaking card. So if you sent me this, please, please comment down below. So with that being said, we're going to get into this video because I have a good amount of bags to show you. And this isn't like a review unboxing. I'm just going to literally show you the bags. And I'll link them all down below. So let's get into it. So this bag right here is from Shein. We're gonna start off with good old Shein. This clutch I have featured in another video, but as an accessory, I didn't link it because it wasn't a part of the video. But I got a lot of questions about it, and this is from Shein, and it is gorgeous. As you can see, it makes a lot of noise, but it is so cute. When I seen this, I just I had to get it. It was sold out for a little minute. And then it came back in stock and I just snatched it up because this is like the perfect bag for vacation. It's really big and as you can see, you flip it up like that and there is the opening for you to put all your stuff in. And like I said, it's a really nice size. It just looks really good under the arm or you can just hold it like this. This one is definitely one of my favorites. And I do plan to go on Shein to get more bags like this because they have a lot of straw vacation, that kind of aesthetic, you know what I mean, on Shein. So I'm definitely gonna go in there and get some more. So this bag right here is also from Shein and I just recently got this probably like a week ago or so, but I just really love this color. I've been really loving like mint, like neon green type of pastel green color. And I just thought this was really cute crossbody bag to throw on. And this right here is detachable. You don't have to keep this on here but i just put it on there so you guys can see but you don't have to have this on here this is obviously like a little chanel inspired bag who knows maybe one day your girl will get a chanel maybe not honestly i'm not really a huge fan of them but they are really nice bags so in the meantime your girl's gonna stick with her she and chanel okay let's 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 stick with that for now and then you know later down the line if your girl is feeling you know fancy i'll get me one but as of right now i'm cool i'm cool with this so yeah this is super cute and we're gonna move on to the next bag. Okay, so next up we have this bag from Eric Javits. I hope that's how you say it. And he has a lot of really, really nice bags. Basically bags that are made for like vacation. They're not made for vacation, but they give like vacation vibes because he has a lot of like bamboo and tassels and just like the vacation aesthetic that a lot of girls or a lot of people are going for now that he has a lot of bags like this and i decided to get this one i've had this bag for like four months now but i've never worn it and i have shown you guys the bag but i didn't actually you know tell you where it was from but this is from eric javits and this is such a nice bag i hope it's like picking up i feel like it's really bright honestly at first i low-key thought this was ugly but then i kept seeing it on like ads and i was like 
dang i really like that so i went ahead and got it and i love it i can't wait to style it and they also have this in like a hot pink they also have this in i think like a black and cream colorway but this one was my favorite so yeah okay so next up we have this really tiny miniature crossbody and this is actually by steve madden and I got this on the Macy's website, but I've seen it on ASOS, which I'm pretty sure it's sold out by now. But I actually purchased this on ASOS originally for the retail, which was too much for this little bag. I want to say it was almost 50 bucks for this. And I was just on the internet one day. And you know how when you're like looking up something or you bought something, you see like ads for things, which is really creepy to me, but whatever. So I seen an ad for this on Macy's and it was on sale. So I was like, oh, let me go see how much it is. This was like less than 20 bucks on Macy's. I was pissed. So you know what I did? I returned the one to ASOS for full price and I bought the one on sale. Yes, I did. I do that. I am that person, okay? I cannot go out like that. I will not take the L. I will return it and get it for cheaper. And ASOS has free returns, so I didn't have to lose any money out of pocket just to send it back. So it was a win-win for me. So this is super cute it's like a really tiny tiny bag so you can't really fit too much in here but i wanted this one because i have more blue things so yeah this one is super cute and i'll link it below even though it's sold out but i'll link it below okay so next up we have us a resale item and i got this on poshmark and i honestly don't know how i came across this because i wasn't even looking for like a coach bag i wasn't really looking for a designer bag at all but i just seen it and i thought it was super cute and i was like i love this i have like some really cute orange pieces that i want to wear so when i seen this i was like you know what i could probably do something with that so here it is she's super cute it's in very very good condition and honestly i don't really do a lot of outfits that are super like year 2k but i do love that aesthetic so i wanted to add more pieces into my collection to kind of you know spice her up a little bit so this one is super cute and yeah i will well i guess there's no point in me linking this below because maybe if i find it i'll link it but if i don't i'll just put next to poshmark like sold out or no link or something like that but this is super cute so this right here is a clutch from zara and i did feature this in a collective haul i didn't feature the bag but i had the bag on in the video and i got a lot of questions about it and this is from zara and I freaking love this clutch. I love how oversized it is, first of all. It's very spacious, it's very big. And as you can see here, there's a lot, okay? A lot of space in here for you to put whatever. I mean, I wouldn't say you could fit like a laptop, but damn near, you could fit an iPad, I'm pretty sure. You could fit an iPad in here, but this is a really nice size and I just really like the colors. I love orange and green together. I just, I don't know what it is I, I like it it's really cute and i don't really wear these two colors together so i wanted to get this to kind of switch up my color palette a little bit and try something different but you guys seen in that video that i styled it with like a white blouse some green pants and like a little orange lace bra and that was really cute but i want to do like a very casual streetwear type of look so i'm still working on that but this is super cute and for those who are asking like i said this is from zara also if y'all see this outfit on instagram in like a month or so pretend like you've never seen it i really wanted to wear this outfit like i have this outfit planned with this and this and some other pieces that i have not worn yet and i was just like listen i just want to put this on in the video because it's cute as hell and i just wanted to be really cute and girly so if you see this on the gram don't worry about it okay this is just y'all getting like a quick little sneak peek of what the outfit's gonna be like but it, i just i had to wear it because i just love it next up we have these and if you guys know you know so these are from yato and if you don't know who that is you should definitely follow on instagram so basically he makes these really really cute fire okay knot bags and he's come out with a bunch of different uh patterns and things like that and i try to get them every chance i get so this was i'm pretty sure a part of his mother's day collection so there's these two right here so this one is like a pink it has like pink green purple all these really pretty colors and this one is giving like more of a purple vibe and then it does have some green some pink it's like a little bit lighter and this one's more vibrant but yeah these I freaking love and if you're wondering how they go you just loop through the hole 
and then you hold the bag like this so i love these bags okay i love them he just did a recent drop two drops actually he did one on juneteenth and the bags that he made he gave away for free so basically when you want to check out it just says zero dollars and you check out and you're good to go and then he also did his classic drop which i'll show you in a minute but i ended up getting one of the juneteenth bags and i also ordered pretty much every color that i didn't have already of the paisley bags so yes these are the first two these are the ones that i get the most questions about these are so freaking beautiful these are gorgeous i love these bags so much i have a really really cute outfit coming up with this one so stay tuned i know i say stay tuned but i really actually have like looks planned it's just been very very shitty weather here in corpus like literally every day for the last week it has rained and it's just killing my vibe and y'all know how i feel about taking pictures when it's raining i just can't do it so i just have looks on top of looks on top of looks just waiting to be posted or to be worn so that i can take pictures in them but you guys have seen me style this one already but this one is coming soon okay these are so gorgeous you see how they just reflect the light like they're so freaking pretty <sighs> my head just fits in there all right let me stop playing let me stop playing so these are i don't know if it was a specific collection but he did have like a pastel collection if you will come out and i got the yellow and i got this really really pretty it's like a teal i guess color and i love these so much they're super cute same thing on the other side nothing special and then i also have this one which you guys have seen already on my Instagram. I styled this with the Rihanna shirt, the stacked jeans, and my lucky green ones. And you guys love that look. I love this color so much. It's so, so cute. And I'm gonna wear this again very, very soon. I haven't worn it because I really don't wear green like that, but I'm starting to get out of my head a little bit about matchy matchy. I'm trying to like switch up colors and switch up patterns and mix things up but it's it's been a struggle okay i'm not gonna lie it's been a struggle but i'm working on it and these are the last two that i have currently but i do have honestly like 12 in route to me of different colors that he's come out with so these i got hmm, early this year maybe the end of last year something like that but he did have like a metallic collection and this one is like a burgundy color and then this one is like a brown and I freaking love these. I have not worn these yet either. And low key, I just be forgetting that I have things because they're like in their packaging, just tucked away. So I forget that I have a lot of stuff. And I'm like, when I do these videos, I'm like, dang, I wanna wear this. Like, what the hell am I doing? But anyways, these are super cute. And now we're gonna move on to the next bags. I have a lot of bags, okay guys? So I'm gonna try to get through this really, really quick, but let's go. Okay, so next up we are moving on to my Brandon Blackwood bags. And if you guys don't know who Brandon Blackwood is, he is a black owned, okay, company that makes really, really, really bomb bags. He has so many different styles of bags and he just recently did a launch of all of his bags. Probably, I, wanted, I can't remember exactly when it was. It was definitely like over a month ago, maybe like two months. And I pre-ordered a bunch of his bags. And I'm just getting them in slowly. Okay, slowly. I'm still waiting on like 11 bags. I know, ridiculous. I know, I know. But I am a true, true, true believer in supporting black luxury brands. I feel like I want them to become the next Gucci, Chanel, all that. So I wanna put my money into those brands to, you know, because why not? These bags are, in my opinion, affordable and accessible to the everyday person. And honestly, yes, they could be considered a little pricey, but I feel like it's worth it. So when I got my first order in, I got my order in these little baggies. They were like wrapped up and stuff like that, but I obviously took all the paper off so I can actually see the bag. So I just wanted to show you guys what these came in. And also I'm gonna show you guys what my recent order came in because they actually came in boxes so i'm just going to go through all the colors that i got so this is the first one which you guys literally just seen on my instagram yesterday i finally found something to rock with this and i loved that look so much i just i've been loving color so y'all get y'all get ready okay get ready for the color but 
This is the first one. She is so, so cute. And it just says, In Systematic Racism. So yeah, this is super, super cute. I love it. I love how tiny it is, but it's also not like super tiny to the point where you can't literally put anything in here. But yeah, and it also does come with a crossbody strap in here as well. So you can loop it on and then you could, you know, wear it like a crossbody. It'll become super casual. Or if you wear it like this, it could be like a really dressy piece. So that's why I love these bags. So I completely messed up that last one. This is the one that I just recently posted in my Instagram picture, but this is like, this is the satin version of that one. So it's, it's the same, but it's not. So yeah, this is the satin. As you can see, she is gorgeous, has a beautiful sheen to her, and she has gold hardware. The last one had silver, and this one also has a crossbody strap as well. Then we have this one right here. This is the denim, and it kind of has like a tie-dye look to it. And this one also has gold hardware as well. And I literally just took this one out of the wrapping. So that's why it still has the plastic on here. But this one is so cute. I have to do a denim on denim look with this one because this, this is everything. I wish I would have had this bag when I wore this outfit. I'll put it up on the screen. I think that would have been a cute look. But it was still cute anyway. But I think this would have been really cute with that to kind of tie in with the denim. But this is one of my favorites for sure. I love this one. And just like the other ones, this one has a crossbody strap as well. So here we have another satin. And this one is pink and she is gorgeous. I don't wear pink often, but I still want to have like pink bags if I absolutely need them. And I have worn like pops of pink and obviously the outfit that I wore yesterday was all pink. But yeah, I've been really loving like different shades of pink lately. So I had to get this one and this one has silver hardware. I'll get close up on all of these so you guys can see them. But yeah, also, I don't think I need to say that every one of them has a crossbody strap. But I just wanted to show you guys in case anyone was going to, you know, purchase these bags or, you know, they want to know. I just want to show y'all. So yeah, this one is super cute. So this one is definitely one of my favorites. This is my baby. Okay, this one is gorgeous. She is, you could consider her lime. You can consider her chartreuse. Just beautiful, okay? Like the color is just so gorgeous and it looks really bright on my viewfinder. So I hope you guys can see it. But this one has silver hardware as well and this one has a crossbody strap which also is like a rope kind of material kind of like the handle it's literally the same material as the handle so yeah this one is so pretty oh my gosh i have to wear this like soon so this one is like the denim one that i showed you but it's a brown and it's like a tie-dye type of look as well this one is super gorgeous and this one's gonna be this one's gonna be a hit, okay, in the fall. I can see it now. I'm gonna be wearing this one a lot because this is like my favorite color to wear in the fall. So I feel like this one's gonna get a lot of wear. She's gonna get a lot of wear. And this one has a crossbody strap as well. So here we have this beauty right here and I'm gonna move it so you guys can actually see what it looks like because it's kind of hard to see it like straight on like this. But this one is like a purple metallic. Oh my God. I have this strap in here because I actually have an outfit that y'all are gonna freaking love, okay, to go with this. And I, it's just, it's on my clothing rack, just waiting to be styled, okay? She's, she's ready to go. But this is so cute. And it kind of just shows you what the strap looks like on there if you wanted to, you know, do the crossbody thing. But this one is gorgeous, okay? Gorgeous. And I don't wear purple. You guys have really never seen me wear purple. I don't know what it is. I love purple, but I just don't wear it like that, you know? So. Y'all are gonna see her real soon, so stay tuned, okay? Okay, so next up we have this one, and this is like, it's giving me like lunchbox vibes. This is so cute, it's baby blue, and it literally is like pretty much a lunchbox low key. And I didn't open the other ones because it was kind of pointless, but I just want to show you guys what this will look like on the inside. It's definitely a lot of space in here. You can definitely fit your phone, you can fit your wallet, you can fit a camera if you vlog okay that'll fit in here too it does have a crossbody strap as well and this one is very very sturdy all of them are very well made i'm pretty sure this is the trunk bag if i'm not mistaken y'all let me know down below i'm pretty sure this is the trunk but yeah this one is super super cute i love this okay so like i said i just recently got 
partial, okay, part of my order in the mail of, I think I ordered like 14 bags and I got one, two, three, four. So I'm waiting on 14 minus four, 10. Okay, there we go, 10. So yeah, this is what they came in. They're all in these boxes that kind of, you know, mimic like shoe boxes, but I love that because my bag was nicely protected and it was also wrapped up in tissue paper that just said Brandon Blackwood all over it and also styrofoam. So it was very, very, very secure. And then when you open the box, it's just the bag in a dust bag. And then when you take it out, it just says Brandon Blackwood all over the inside. It's very, very nice. I'm gonna keep these boxes to store the bags in just to keep them protected. So this is another trunk and this is like a mauve pink color. <sighs> this is so beautiful. I love this freaking color so much, so much. I love it. This is so pretty. It's like that mix between like pink and purple. It's a very unique, very unique color, but I love it so much. And it literally is the same trunk as the baby blue one I showed you. Okay, so next up we have another purple bag. And like I said, when I showed you the other one, I don't really have any purple bags. So I had to get all the purple bags that he had because, well, not all of them, but I wanted to get a couple of them, like different shades because I don't, I don't have any and I love purple. So I want to start wearing it more. So that's why I got this one. This is another trunk. This is so, so pretty. I love it, y'all. I don't even really know what to say. Like this is pretty much my first time really looking at it because I took it all out of the packaging right before this video and I didn't look at them I just kind of like took it out real quick but these are so so nice and it just says Brandon Blackwood embossed right here and then it says New York and these are so 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 nice I love these so much these are these are about to be my new favorite bags okay y'all know I love me some Telfars I love them but it's time to retire them, okay, for a little bit because sis, I'm tired of wearing them. I mean, I'm never sick of wearing them, but I don't always want to wear a freaking tail bar bag. Like, I literally will be looking at my collection and, like, not wearing an outfit or posting it because I just don't want to wear another tail bar bag. Like, I, I need, I need a variety, okay? So, I'm excited that these are finally coming in. So, yeah, this one is super, super cute. Ooh, so next up we have a suede, and she is giving, like, denim a little bit. But this is so freaking pretty. I hope it's coming up like it is, like from my eyes, because this is so, so pretty. It's like so pretty. I don't know, it's giving like, it kind of looks gray and then blue. I don't know, maybe that's just me, but this is so, so nice. I also like that it's kind of like smoky in a sense. And the Brandon Blackwood logo is like a charcoal, like a black type of color. So it literally makes it look very smoked out, which I love. This is so, so nice. So freaking nice. I can't wait to wear this. I have nothing currently that I could think of to wear with this, but I'm gonna find something, okay? I'm gonna find something to wear with this bag. Okay, so I know I said that the purple metallic Brandon Blackwood bag was my favorite, but this one is probably my favorite, okay? This is a mini. A mini trunk okay first of all i hope the color is coming up on camera because it is very bright it's very vibrant but this is so freaking cute this is like a satin material and it does have like a bronzy gold hardware which i think looks really good with this color and i just it's so freaking cute now this my phone is not going in here but I could definitely put my wallet, I could put um, some lip gloss, my cars, some money, you know, something. So this is the last Brandon Blackwood bag that I have. So now we're gonna move on to the Tail Feezies. Y'all have pretty much already seen my collection. If you follow me on Instagram, you follow me on TikTok, you've kind of seen, you know, the ridiculousness of my Telfar collection. So in this video, I'm just gonna be showing you guys my favorite ones for summer specifically. The ones that are like summer colors, the ones that I've been going to a lot recently when i've been going out places and stuff like that i'm only going to be showing you those i'm not going to be showing you my entire collection okay so now we are moving on to the very last portion of this video and before we even get to this portion of the video i just need to make a quick disclaimer because anytime i wear one of these bags i show one of these bags i've shown you guys my collection there's like this big uproar about these bags okay so if you do not like Telfar bags if you think they look cheap if you don't understand why i have them or why i have all these colors or sizes 
if you don't understand the hype behind them if you don't like them okay i don't want to hear that i don't care personally i'm not a normal y'all i do not care people come at me like i created these bags and it's very annoying honestly at this point so i just need to put that out there because every time i post anything about a tail bar bag it's like she must be on an influencer list she must be getting sent these bags because what the hell how do you have all those colors easy i get on the website when they drop and i check out when they become available and i get them i don't know it's actually quite insulting okay just because i'm an influencer does not mean that i get sent everything that i own so all of these bags i have purchased with my own money literally i don't know why i even have to say this but i always get comments about me being on some secret influencer list or something it makes no sense because they don't even have that and if they did you guys would know that and that's just that okay nothing more nothing less okay because there's so freaking many i'm not about to sit here and show you each one by one i'm going to show you them all together with their sizes and stuff like that but the first one that i'm loving is the yellow obviously yellow is like it has summer written all over it but i do have the small and the large i think i have the medium i just can't find it honestly i don't know I don't know i definitely have the medium i just don't know where it is but yeah this is the small one and this is the large and these are just perfect i cannot wait to wear this yellow large one because it is so bright and bold and like it's just it's an eye catcher okay so this is the og right here this is literally the first telvar bag that i ever bought i bought her in white and i styled it i put the picture over here in that photo and I've been in love ever since like literally literally i just love them i do have this in small and large but like i said i have a whole box of tail bars in there and i just did not feel like going through all of it because i had to take all these bags out of their bags and i was over it so yeah so next up we have a recent favorite of mine that he dropped and this is the double mint and you guys have seen this on my instagram as well and i freaking love this color i didn't get the large one because i didn't really want the large one and this i don't know i don't know i don't know maybe if they drop it again i'll definitely get it the next time around but i didn't really care to get it the first time so yeah this is double mints and she is beautiful okay i don't know who told me to put this damn tree right here because i keep hitting it girl anyway next up we have painter's take and this is basically like a cobalt blue and i have the small the medium and the large and this one, I had to get all the colors because number one, cobalt blue is like, literally, it's literally my favorite color now. I've been obsessed with cobalt blue for a minute. I just don't wear it. I don't really have many pieces that are cobalt blue, but, or like a royal blue too. But um, yeah, this, these are definitely probably one of my favorites out of the Telvar bags that have come out recently. This one and the one that I'm gonna show you later on. But yeah, these are cobalt, I mean, painter's tape they're called painter's tape so yeah these are super cute like i said small medium large and i'm going to be styling this bad boy really soon so stay tuned on the gram okay so next up we have pool blue and i have small medium and the large and i just love these i love the name number one because it literally reminds me of like going to the pool but i really love this color it's so pretty it's like a powder Kind of like a baby blue a little bit a little bit more vibrant though but these are super super cute definitely one of my favorite colors as well and we're gonna move on because i still got a lot more to show y'all so next up we have another one of my ogs these were like one of the earlier telfar bags that i had probably like the third or fourth maybe but these are the orange and these are literally one of my favorite ones as well because they're so so vibrant I will put up any photos that I've styled these bags when I show you them, but this is the small and this is the medium. I freaking love this. It's literally like orange. Okay, this is orange. When you think of orange, this is orange. I love this bag so, so much. Definitely a pop of color for a lot of looks that I've done and definitely a statement piece for sure and perfect for summer. And yeah, these are definitely one of my favorite colors as well. This one was like an OG. I've had these for a minute now, so I really, really love these bags so, so much. And I'm definitely going to get the large one whenever he drops the orange one again. Okay, so next up we have Miss Azalea. And this was one of the recent colors he's dropped. 
this year and I love Azalea, okay? I didn't get the large one, but I'm kind of regretting it because when I got this in person, my eyes were just like, like shook because this color is so pretty and the freaking camera is not doing it any justice at all, like at all. But these are definitely, definitely, hands down, one of my favorite colors. I know I said that about like all the other colors, but this one is for sure one of my favorites. And honestly, this was one of the colors that I was a little iffy about because like I said, I don't wear pink, but this is so, so, so pretty. So pretty. I should have got the large one, but I will be getting her the next time they drop. And yeah, these are super, super cute. Okay, so next up we have eggplant. And I also got this one in small, medium, and large. And I love the color. I love the name of the color because it's spot on, actually. And I just really like this color. I feel like I'm more so going to wear this like in the fall so i'm not really sure why i showed you guys this one this one was one of the recent colors he dropped so that's why i put it in this video but this is definitely going to be a fall favorite for me because it's such a rich deep just a really nice juicy <laughs> tone and i really like this a lot so yeah these are eggplants and we're going to move on to the next okay so next up we have bubblegum and i love the name because it goes perfectly with this color and this was a color that I kept missing. Like it would drop and I'd be like, crap, I freaking missed it. And I was finally able to get the pink. I didn't get the large one because like I said, I'm not a big pink girl, but I do always feel like I can get something out of the small and the medium. I don't necessarily need the large. I feel like the large is for traveling really, but I get the large in certain colors because either I really love that color or I just want all the colors in that specific bag but this one i didn't really want the large one so i just have the medium and it's small and it works perfectly fine for me okay so y'all already knew that the red one was going to be in this video y'all just knew like i feel like y'all knew that but they are literally my favorite telfars because i just y'all know how i feel about a pop of red whether that be my lip my bag my heels whatever and these are just everything so i have the small the medium and the large of course and as you can see i have not i have not worn this one yet but it's it's coming i'll definitely wear the red large one before i wear any of the other large ones because the red one is just i definitely feel like my red so far are the most worn because i just i love me a pop of red like i just love it so much um obviously i haven't worn this one but this is probably the most worn color that i have aside from my black one because that is my movie bag like i literally take my black medium one to the movies because it's like the perfect size but these are the red ones and i have one more color okay one more color that is one of my favorites for the summer so let's get going okay so i hope you guys can see this because it's looking really vibrant on my viewfinder but this is the color green screen and i absolutely love the names of these colors i love it so much but this is a small i literally just took it out of the packaging this is a medium and this is large and I love this color so much. So that's why I had to get all three sizes. And I have not worn any of these yet, but I'm, I'm coming up with something because I freaking love this color. It's so, so pretty. It's definitely not as vibrant as it's coming up on camera, but it's a really, really nice green. I feel like I need to get some green sneakers or some sneakers that have this really pretty green in it because I really want to do a like streetwear type of look with this green one. I don't know what it is about this green, but I need to do like a real casual like sneaker fit with this and I also would love to dress it up as well but I think a really really cute streetwear look would just be fire okay with this color so yeah this is the last color that I'm loving for the summer and the last bags in today's video okay guys so like I said that was the last bag I had in today's video I hope you guys enjoyed this you guys have been asking to see some of my favorite bags for the summertime and these are it I do have a lot more bags on the way. So if you guys wanna see like a part two or maybe add them into like a collective haul, then let me know down below. Give this video a huge thumbs up for your girl. I will be doing another Telfar giveaway very, very soon. I actually just hit 200K on Instagram finally. Like it's been a long time coming. So there will definitely be another giveaway coming. I promise you guys very, very soon. If you missed out on the last one, definitely be sure to follow me on Instagram. And if you don't, I think this time around I do plan to do one on YouTube and one on Instagram so that it's a fair chance because I know a lot of people don't necessarily have Instagram. So yeah, let me know down below if that's what you guys want 
or if you're just gonna be over there on Instagram, y'all let me know. And yeah, follow me on Instagram, like I said, because you guys definitely wanna stay up to date. I have a lot going on right now and I'm gonna be letting you guys know what's going on really, really soon. So let me know down below if you guys want a vlog of me kind of explaining what's been going on just in general behind the scenes or if you guys want me to do like a chit chat voiceover type of get ready with me. So I'm just gonna be doing my makeup and my hair and stuff like that and just talk to you guys in a voiceover letting you know what's going on or if you have any other ideas if you want to know what's going on okay let me know down below and with that being said we're gonna get out of here because i have to put up all these bags to put up all these bags y'all thumbs up let's get her to 3,000 likes for your girl follow me on instagram like i said and i will see you all in my next video bye